everybody welcome back to the channel we are in the bay of quinty again today i think it's like day 10 or 11 now had a couple days that were pretty slow last week didn't end up making any videos out of it but today we just went through a brutal cold spell for the last two days it was minus 48 yesterday morning and a spot that is near and dear to my heart that i have long awaited this winter to get out to is finally frozen Long Reach out of Napanee in the Bay Quinty has about four to six inches ice. So we are out here today. There's quite a few tents, maybe 20 or 30 tents. I don't think the secret's too out of the bag yet, so not the whole crowd that's pushed down. But the guys that I talked to last night, when we came and set up a tent and fished for an hour, everybody said they had caught fish. So we're here, we're placed in about 30 feet of water. I will be starting with the Frostbite Deadbolt, paired with the Frostbite Diesel 1000 and a big jigging wrap number seven in perch. Randy will be starting with a tantrum and we're hoping to call them in and rip some lips. Today is going to be the day we're going to get a big one today. I can feel it. So without further ado, don't forget go down below, subscribe, all that good stuff. Give a like, comment on what you want to see and uh, let's get fishing. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It's perfect, Randy. Go up with it a little. Don't go up with it anymore. Wow, they really don't want the jigging wrap. Like, almost negative to it. I'm gonna catch one right now because my rod's tangled. Missed him. I gotta fix this. Tell me what he's doing. He's gone. Okay, good. Why is that two bumps and then I have another one? Like, why are they just bumping it? Like, why isn't he, how isn't he not grabbing it? He's racing over to you. Don't worry about it, I got this camera going already. Nice fish. He's gonna eat it. Dude, I'm sure he's gonna crush you. I'm for sure he's gonna smash you. Your lure like became one with the fish for a second. I was watching your rod because I was so sure he was gonna eat it. Yeah, I was waiting for it. I was like, do I, do I stop bouncing? Or do I do it? <laughs> Steve got one, guys. Beauty fish. Nice one. Yeah. I think a four pounder, five pounder. Chase, 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 and bang, hammered it. Swedish pimple, spoon bite. Here I am with jigging wraps. Can't get them to commit. It's a nice fish. I take one of those. Hell yeah. Cool. Thank you, buddy. Yeah. Go up with it, up with it. Stay there and just jig it on the spot. Give it a little rip. A little one, yeah. Bounce on the spot. Drop it down a little bit. Rip. It's a little bit of an aggressive color. Maybe go with something more natural. Yeah, maybe. Because they seem to like the rattle. It seems to be the most, the thing they're the most interested in right now. It's just not closing the deal. Go with this gold one. Should have just a snap that you can undo it. Leave that one out. We'll go back to it if they seem to be doing the same thing or less aggressive. This guy's gonna smash me. He's coming back to eat it. The big one. There's so many walleye right now. Like so many. This is a school of like 15. Look at him coming. That one's coming up for you. Bounce on the spot. It's gonna crush you. There's two coming up for you. Try not to have your line leaning against the side of the ice like that. You don't feel the bite. Dude, there's so many walleye right now. These are all walleye. There's like six on the screen. You have three coming up for you. That's a giant coming. It's a giant coming. In between us, it's going to you. It's a giant, dude. They're leaving. How do we not get one fish out of that screen? Like, what the f On the end of all, Jean. Why is it so sick? Jean, 15 au même temps. Okay. Là, moi, je vais voir une belle photo pour aller la prendre tête dehors. Hey, good yeah. job. Hey, t'as vu dans ça, je ratais là. I'm just gonna dead stick and wait for a 12 pounder. Oh, this is a bigger fish than I thought it was. Oh. 
one in the pocket. I just put blue. <laughs> blue, not purple, blue. There we go. Walleye, number one for our tent. It's been actually uh, not bad. I've missed two. This is the first one we've put on the ice, but uh, my clients over there caught like a five pounder and a small one a little bit smaller than this. Steve got a five pounder, missed a few, and we are seeing all kinds of fish. So good start to the morning. I knew it was gonna be a late bite. The bite has been late for the last two weeks in the other spots, so I figured why not this spot? But that's keeper number one for us of the day. We are gonna keep a few fish today. I think everybody's keeping fish because uh, yeah, it goes fast. I like eating fish and it's uh, yummy. So first little snack roll of the day. Let's get back to it. Breaking necks. Yeah, there's one there. Oh on you. Eat it, please. Please eat it. He's gonna eat it. He's gonna eat it. He's gonna eat it. He's gonna eat it. Oh, he missed it. He missed it. He tried for it and missed it. It's coming back. Gonna eat it. Oh yeah. Better fish. Better fish. Yeah, nice one. Tanker. <laughs> Look how much you swallowed that. Oh my god. <laughs> get, get me a blue spoon. <laughs> Eight pounder. All right, guys. There is my second fish of the day. Beauty fish. He absolutely choked the jigging wrap. Like, it's gone. Gonzo. In his mouth, gone. That fish. Did not hesitate. He was definitely gonna eat. Made a color change. That blue and silver jigging wrap. I just dropped it on the ground and broke it. Oh, that's a big one. Yeah. That's a big one. It was the only blue and silver I had. I'll get a quick measure over here. Mouth closed, 25. Beautiful fish, man. Uh, yeah. Seven, four. Yeah, five. Seven five. Seven, seven and five. a half. Look at that beauty! Big girl. Oh, oh my god, okay, she's gone. The most best release ever. Not. Seven and a half pounder, little biggest one for let's me. Let's go, you've been waiting for the big boy, dude. Finally. Let's go! Alright, let's get back to jigging. I said it was gonna be a late bite, and it is eleven o'clock and the fish are turning on, so let's get some more big ones. Yes! Let's go. He just showed up on me and just came up and ate it. Dude, because I was looking, I wasn't sure because like he was right on your lure. Yeah. And then you moved your lure just the tiniest bit up and I saw the little space and I was like, dude, you're, there's one on you. <laughs> he was on me. He literally came in like on it. And he had missed the first time? He missed it. You saw him lunge at it and it, I didn't feel it. Like he just went by the bait, missed the bait. That's a giant. No, big jigs. That was a giant, it's a school of them. Why well, they all gotta leave us? Oh, here we go. That was so many fish again. Oh no. Give it a rip. It's gonna turn. That's a big one. Another good bump. Yeah, a couple more, couple more, couple more, couple more. He likes them. Yeah. Bouncing on the spot now. Oh, the other one's coming for you. It's two big fish, too. Three, three coming for you. That's a giant too. That's a giant. Man, <laughs> it hurts in my stomach. Eleven thirty. Just three giants roll in after a school of giants five minutes ago. He almost hit your lure. Oh my god! <laughs> did you see him? <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> he totally dodged it. I was hoping for a second he was like, no, I'm going back for the other one, and like 100%, like I'm taking it, you know. <laughs> I knew it's too good to be true. So many fish right now, this is a giant dude. If he eats you, it's a giant. He 
I got one on me too. Nice one. There's so many. Like those are all walleye to your right. They're just taking turns going and looking at it. Drop it down. Dude, there's so many fish right now. Yes, sir. Get him, Randy. Get him, Randy. I got a big one coming up. Double header, maybe? <laughs> First Quinty Walleye. First Quinty Walleye. I got like three on me. Down the same hole? Isn't yep. Ciao, bye. Ciao, bye, buddy. Thank you. Randy's first Quinty Walleye. All right, the ice is broken. Let me get that guy. Fish on the screen right now? It's hard. I, I like, if I move away for two seconds, I don't know which one my lure is. I got see it's like 15 fish on the screen. I think it's a whole school drum. Like, yeah, there's a few walleye mixed in there, but... Yeah. can't believe I didn't even touch one. Dude, there's so many fish. Hey, guys. Look at this. Look at this. We're clearing out now because we started jigging in them, but... It's full. That had been a school drum or something. There's so many of them. But not one was interested. Like all those are drum, but that's a walleye coming up to you, definitely. Yeah, hey, you got a big walleye on you. He's gonna eat you. That's a big one. That's a big one. That's a big one. That's a big one, dude. No, don't loosen it. Don't loosen yeah. it. No. 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 You lost him. No. How come? That was a giant. How come? I don't know. He had him pinned so good, too. Dude. That was a giant. Uh, that was a 10 pounder. Dude, man. That was a giant. Uh, that's what I'm talking about. How we do everything right and they come on pins. Like, I, I didn't horse him. I was waiting. And yeah. <laughs> the drag was good. He could run. Oh. The feeling of my. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm sick. I'm sick to my stomach right now. Dude, you could barely move him. Like you only brought him up like four feet. <sighs> A giant. Get that one, Randy. That's your redemption fish. I'm telling you. He's gonna eat it too. He's gonna eat it. Six landed, that's good. You, how are you guys? What about that? Since the big one? Uh, no, we still only got three. And then in the tent, it's not like they're having a good Yeah, they just, they just got one. A nice one? Yeah, they've, uh, yeah, a keeper. They've had four. Let's go. Scissor kick. Nice fish. Come on. Eat the scissor kick. Oh, that's a nice fish. Might have stopped them. Big fish. Big fish. I can't do anything right now. It's just the side that blew in. We should probably put a peg there too. It's gonna do it. Mine's coming back. Lost him. Still there. Lost him. It's coming back. I tried to tighten my drag because it was too loose. Pretty sure I lost both my minnows. No! That was a giant. That was a 12. That was 30 inch plus for sure. Lost both minnows. I can't believe I just lost that fish. Alright, little update time. So it's been tough, but at the same time, good. We ended up having, I landed that seven and a half pounder and my clients had two fish, biggest being around five pounds. Steve had two fish, biggest being around five pounds. I also landed like that two pounder. But me and Randy both had heartbreaks, both losing big fish, one on a Swedish pimple and the other on the scissor kick, a purple scissor kick. And uh, we just made the connection that fish were coming in, not 
interacting with my jigging wrap how I wanted to, spooking off it. So Steve had caught that fish on a uh, Swedish pimple, which is silver with a little bit of orange. So we put Randy on a Swedish pimple. He lost that big fish. I decided to go to the jigging wrap in a silver and blue. Nailed those two fish back to back this morning. And then that fish actually, the big fish broke the wing off the jigging wrap. My only silver and blue. So with going to that purple scissor kick, kind of same coloration, silver and blue, silver, purple. And uh, I ended up losing a big one too as well. So it seems to be that they're targeting in less on perch in this deep water and more on like the shad or like a minnow uh, coloration of a profile bait. So like blue silver, uh, maybe silver gold, something like that. But just silver in general seems to be the key. So it is 1.32 and uh, it's been a little bit slow. We just saw some fish come in and uh, we're hoping that the afternoon uh, evening bite picks up and we can have please, please one more chance at a big fish because we have seen so many giants today and they are just not committing other than the two that we lost. So hoping that those hooks penetrate a little bit better next time and uh, get one topside for you guys to see. Let's get back to fishing. Do it. Nosing up to it. There's another big one down there too. Oh, scared them. Scared both of them. Rookie move. No! No! I thought I should drop under him and he did not like that. Big one. Big one. Everyone's flying in. He's gonna need it. Yes, yes, yes. Get her, yes sir. What a scoop. What, what a, a scoop. scoop. What a scoop. <laughs> we got one. You wanna turn that button a little bit? Drop down again. I don't got minnows on or anything. There we go. Another nice little keeper. And uh, that's the second fish we're gonna keep today. Steve and them have had seven fish. We've had four fish now. Clients have had four fish. There's a fish on me right now, I think. That's my beat. So yeah, second little keeper. Awesome little fish, little gravel lizard there. Number two that we're gonna keep. He just squirted everywhere. Oh, he's pointing towards it. He's turning around for it. That's a walleye, it's 15 pounds. Come on. Please. Please let this one eat it. If there's any time to pray, it's for this fish right now. Oh, my minnow just came off. Right in his face. Come on, come back up to it. He was coming at a steady pace. He go. No. That was a giant, dude. Yes, it was. That was like a giant. Your minnow. <laughs> well, guys, that is going to wrap it up. We're in the truck right now. I still have my headlamp on. But we are done. It was so nice to get back in this spot. Finally, we're able to get a little bit of ice here and uh, the fish were biting. Me and Randy both had two big fish missed opportunities and uh, both fish probably over that 10 pound mark. But I ended up getting my biggest of the trip so far. So that is a bonus, seven and a half pounder. And I'm hoping that we can still up that. I'd like to get that double digit for this year. And uh, it's not that because they're not here because everybody's been getting into them except for me. So. Hoping, still waiting, and uh, still a lot of Quinty left. So thanks for checking out this week's video, guys. I got a long road ahead of me, but I'll be back in a couple more days filming more content and hopefully getting more giant gold bars. See you guys then.